Hey y'all, welcome back to Underdog Magician Tarot. This is your girl Cheeky. So I'm gonna do a video explaining myself and how I feel. Now this is no disrespect to everybody that has their own opinion. The ones that have been commenting, you know, I, I respect everybody's opinion. I don't have nothing negative to say. But I do want to put this out there. When it comes to me, I am a original person. I'm original, you know. I'm old school. I'm 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 old fashioned, whatever you want to call it. I understand that this may be a competitive business when it comes to, you know, readers and all that, but I am in competition with no one. With no one. I am not on here to present my looks to anybody. I'm not on here to look good for the next person or to try to look better than the next person. This is me. I would be the same way if I was rich and had a bunch of money. I would probably still look this way. So some of you may judge the way that I look and think that this is why I'm not receiving some of the things because I tend to look this way or that way. But guess what? This is me. I'm an original person. You know, I mean, I'm not saying I don't get dressed. I don't, you know, do my hair. I don't do this and that. But I don't wear makeup. I don't wear lashes and all that stuff. I don't I don't always do those things. I don't always keep my nails done. You know, I don't always keep my toes done. I mean, half of the time, you know, growing up, I was a tomboy. So, those things aren't really, like, important to me. What's important to me is me taking care of myself, my health, my children, and, you know, my surrounding areas. But being in competition when it comes to this, you know, business here, that's that's not my thing, man. I'm not out here trying to beat the next person. I'm doing this because it's I love what I do. I love to inspire other people with the the gift that I have to be able to inspire. You know, I'm able to give the the messages that I'm receiving from the higher up to be able to help somebody else on their journey. You know what I'm saying? I'm not here for 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 all the the fame and shit, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, no disrespect to nobody. I understand that y'all want to see me a certain type of way or you have seen me that way. But guess what? God has always told me to show up exactly how for uh, God God has always told me to show up exactly how I was. I didn't need the the look just to be noticed, you know what I'm saying? Like the gift that you have, that you're blessed with, is going to get you noticed. If my messages are resonating with people out there, they're going to subscribe and support me regardless. It's not about because I look good or my breast is showing or I got lashes on or I got my nails done or I got my background. Dec That's not it, bro. That's material shit. You know, that will come eventually when things start flowing that way in my life. But I'm not hell bent on getting there that fast. You know, I just ex I just experienced, you know, a major um, change in my life. So, I'm not working on trying to hurry up and get back to material things. I'm working on me. You know, I'm doing I'm doing what I gotta do for myself. Now, me delivering the messages is what I love to do. Me inspiring others is what I love to do. Me giving others guidance is what I love to do. But me sitting up here trying to look pretty and show off my body and get my nails done and be all dialed up, that's not what I'm here for, man. And I'm just being real, you know. I'm being real with everybody. Like I said, I don't have no animosity towards nobody. This is I'm not calling out. I'm not calling nobody out. I'm not. I'm not mad at nobody. But you know, it's just some of the things that I have been seeing, and I feel like. I want to speak up for myself, you know. I'm going to speak up for myself. All these readers that are on YouTube are, you know, I don't feel in my heart that they're they're not they're they're out here trying to get rich and famous off of their looks. It's not about that. It's about you being blessed with the gift to be able to deliver the messages from the higher up, from your ancestors, from their ancestors, and so on and so on. This is not about competition when it comes to being beautiful. You're beautiful just the way you are. That's just like somebody going out here wanting to get surgery because they feel like they're not beautiful. The way God made you is beautiful. And I'm not judging people that get surgery. I'm just saying it's just not my thing right now to be focused on my beauty. 
if I'm able to wake up every day to get on this laptop and to deliver the messages that resonate with people out there, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do that. I don't care how stressed out I get. I don't care how many times I got to stop and record that video. I don't even give a damn how many times my kids run back and forth and make noises or say shit that ain't even supposed to be said. But I'm still going to get that message out there. Because regardless of how I look, I'm an original person. You know? This is me. The person that you see right now, that's me. The person that you talk to on the phone when you're getting reading, that's me. I'm not going to change. I'm not trying to change. I'm not trying to beat the next person to the punch neither. Because at the end of the day, I was always taught slow and steady wins the race, bruh. I'm an underdog, baby. I'm a late bloomer. And, and I, I, I accepted that. It's been times where I didn't accept that. I, I couldn't appreciate the fact that everybody was before me. But the ones that were the ones that were before you will become last. The ones that was last will be, you know, will, will come first. Like that's how I see it. I had to ex accept that though, as a person, as a as a divine feminine, as a tarot reader, as a high priestess, or whatever you want to call me. But I am in no competition with the next person because of the because of their beauty. I watch a lot of people on YouTube, and everybody is beautiful to me, whether they look good or they don't. Because at the end of the day, it's not the beauty that I'm listening to; it's the words that I'm, you know, I'm resonating with, what they're talking about, what they're coming at, whether it's my situation or somebody else's that I know. That's the shit that I'm listening to. I'm, I'm, I'm focusing in on that. I'm not focusing on oh, oh, her hair. Oh, oh, God, her. Her, her her shirt dirty. Oh, oh her shirt baggy. Oh, her her nails not done. Oh, her oh her teeth is crooked. Nah, that's not. I'm not focused on that, man. I'm not focused on that. Like I said, I am not directing this towards nobody. I'm not being smart or being ignorant. I'm just putting it out there that I am not here to boost myself up when it comes to this um, opportunity with material things. I'm here to boost myself up because I have a gift. And I want to share it with others, with, with, with you all that I resonate with. I mean, you either with me or you against me, but that's just how I feel, man. You know, I'm a real person. Everybody that comments, I know y'all real people. But this is this is me, you know. This is cheeky. This is this is who you see, whether I look good or not. You know, it's, it will be days where you might see me with my shit together. You might see me wearing nails or... Jumping into that feminine energy, but most of the time I'm mainly in this masculine energy where it's just like it's whatever. Like this is just me because I'm an original person. I'm old school. You know what I'm saying? I rock what I rock. I don't go to the malls and shop. I shop at Dollar General, Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, Walmart. Yeah, like I don't shop at the mall, big malls and, and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't do that. You know, I'm, I'm an original person. I like stupid shit, if you want to call it that. I don't like name brand clothes and all this and that. I'll go to the store and buy me some leggings, a t-shirt, and some Crocs and be straight. Like, that's that. For real. Same thing with my kids. Like, I'm not finna have them going out in the public wearing all these brand names. But, I mean, I'm not judging nobody that do that. I respect y'all hustle. But I'm a different kind of person. I'm a different kind of breed. I'm cut from a different cloth, man. And, you know, I just want y'all to respect that. Respect that I don't come like everybody else. Yes, I am rare. Because I'm not coming on YouTube to show off my beauty for you to like me. If my beauty got to be up to par for you to like me, then you don't like me. Straight up. You don't like me, you don't care about me, you just care about how I look. And if I'm ugly, then you don't want to fuck with me. But that's fine. That's fine. Because I came into this world basically alone, you might as well say. I came into this world alone. I, I done suffered and, 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 and fucking dealt with battles on my own. I've been on my own. I've been alone. I've been abandoned. I've been with nothing. My kids too. But I'm not coming back. As strong as I am, just to look good. I'm coming back because I have a purpose. This is my destiny. I was put here for a reason. God saved my life from this stroke for a reason. Because I was meant to be here. If I wasn't, he would have took me then. 
if I was meant to be ugly, he would have made me uglier than this. I wouldn't have no man or no children or, or, or family or nothing. Would, you know, any of that shit. I wouldn't have nothing. I will just be a little girl walking around trying to find love and making all the wrong decisions in life. But I'm not. I'm trying to do the right thing. And I'm trying to help others and inspire them to also do the right things regardless of how you look at what you've been through. Because sometimes when you go through shit, you don't look like what you've been through. Because if you would have seen how I look... When I was going through it, then you'll probably have a whole lot more to say versus what you got to say about me now. But like I said, this is not, I'm not directing this to nobody, you know, directly. I'm just saying, I'm just putting it out there, bro. I'm an original person. I am myself. I'm not in competition with nobody. I'm not trying to beat the next person. We are all the readers that, all the readers that are on YouTube are all doing the same thing because they have a gift to be able to do that. They have a gift to inspire others, to guide others, to help others. Now, if some of them are in competition, then that's their business, but I'm not. I'm not even worrying about their business. I respect every last reader on YouTube, and I don't care if they know me or not. I respect the fuck out of them, because I understand. Some of them are beautiful as shit. Some of them can sit in their house and have all these beautiful things behind them and, 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 and lights and, and their nails done and lashes and hair. and I mean, that's just their life, though, bro. They straight. Some of them live in big-ass, beautiful houses and mansions and shit, but that's just them. Everybody has their own journey to a point where they, they will have that, too, but it's taking a little bit more time for them to get there because they're still fighting through shit. They're still, they still got battles. They got a damn... Fucking overcome with people that they're still dealing with that's around them right now. Like me, man. Like me. It ain't my time to live that beautiful life right now that I always promised myself and my kids. But I know it's coming. I'm not saying it ain't gonna come. I know it's gonna come. But I'm not gonna force that I'm not gonna force that right now in my predicament, knowing that I'm not I'm not stopped that way. I'm not built that way. I'm not building my foundation that way. The foundation that I'm building is going to last for a long time. It's going to be able to support my kids, their kids, and so on and so on. It's going to be generations of my foundation that's going to live on through me. For real. I'm an original person, man. This is, this, is, this is who you're going to see. This is what you get. If you don't like what you see and what you get, then, I mean, shit, there's other people out there you can watch that can give you that look, that talk. That, that, you know, that whatever, whatever, it is, whatever it is, that beauty, I don't know. I don't know, man, but I respect everybody's opinion. I do. I really do, but I'm just letting you know right now, that's not me, man. I'm not that girl. I've been through too much in my life to try to sit up here and spend up all my money just to make sure my background look good. For what? For what? When you can just be yourself. Be you. You ain't, you ain't gotta be like somebody else by having the background they have or or whatever. At the end of the day, I feel good most days and most days I don't. Everybody don't wake up every day just happy as fuck. That's not how life goes. You wake up some days and you just don't feel good. You stressed out. Especially if you got people constantly attacking you because they don't want you to wake up. They don't want you to grow. They don't want you to get up here every day and be persistent and consistent when it comes to your business or what you're trying to build. They want you to be wore out. They want you to feel like you ain't shit. But I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna let that shit beat me, man. I'm a strong individual. I'm a very strong individual. I'm not saying I'm perfect either. I've been I've been through shit. I have. I didn't suffer through shit. I have but like I said, I'm not gonna stop. I'm not gonna stop. And I'm not gonna change because somebody else want me to change. Somebody want me to look a certain type of way. At the end of the day if you want me to look like this and that then donate. If my looks matter to you, then help me help you then. Donate to me. Donate to my channel. Straight up. Because that's ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, this is not, I'm not coming at nobody, y'all. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just letting you know I am original, bruh. I'm original. I'm old school. What's that? What is that? The curtain moving by itself? The dog over there? Ain't nobody over there? Oh, shit. <laughs> I just seen 1444. Yeah. I guess my spirit team in here, like, yeah. 
You right. Let them know. My blinds is moving by themselves. My son was looking at them. I don't know. Maybe they were just flicking my blinds back and forth. I wish I would have had it like this so y'all could see it. It's on that side behind that curtain. But, like I said, y'all, I love everybody. I love every last one of y'all. Every last tarot card reader out here, I got fucking mad respect for. I am not hating on nobody. I don't care how many followers they got. I don't, I don't care how many donations they get a day. Bro, I don't give a damn. I respect that shit. That's what's up. That's they hustle. I will be. I will make it there soon myself. I'll get there. I'll be there. But I'm not. I'm not in competition with the next person to get there. I'm not gonna rush myself to get there either. I'm gonna take my time. I wasn't. I wasn't taught to step on the next person just to get ahead. No sir. I was taught. To do the work myself. Because when I build it, it's firm. Me taking it ain't going to last long. Feel me? And when I build that shit the way I build it, that shit going to stand for a long motherfucking time. Because I know how I built it and why I built it. I didn't want to take it from the next person. I won't in competition to have more than the next person. I built this shit because it needs to be built for my family, for my children, for their children, for my generation. Period. Period, man. But like I said, I love y'all. I hope this video, you know, I hope y'all understand me in this video. I hope y'all do because like I said, I'm not I'm not trying to be mean. I'm not coming off ignorant or disrespectful or none of that. But I just I just had to put this out there. It's been, like, spirit has been, like, banging at me to just, you know, say how you feel. It's not being mean. Just say how you feel. And I'm doing it. To the ones that are here, I appreciate y'all. To the ones that subscribe to my channel, I respect and appreciate y'all, bro. I do. I respect your opinions. I respect y'all comments. I respect y'all y'all prayers. All that, man. But you got to respect me, too. Because this is me. I'm not here to look good for you. I'm here to inspire you. I am here to help you on your journey when you're starting to wake up spiritually. Giving you a little bit of advice on your next your next steps. Or your future. Same way I was before I even became who I am now. I was doing the same shit watching YouTube trying to figure out my, you know, how, I, how am I going to go about this and that. I mean, it ain't always going to happen that day, but eventually you'll start thinking about the shit when it come, when it come into fruition. Like, man, I remember like two years ago. Um, I was looking, I was looking at a YouTube and this girl did a reading and said one day I will be this and be that, and it's now here. It's showing up now. Like that shit can take forever, but the moment it do come, you gonna go back and remember that somebody did tell you that you was gonna be in that position one day. That's what I'm here for, man. That's all I'm here for. I'm just here to inspire you. I'm here to uplift you. I'm here to keep you going. Even if I can't keep going myself, I'm, I want to keep you going. Even if I ain't receiving the love that I deserve, I want to love you. I want to give you the love that you that you deserve, bro. Straight up. Straight up. Whether I talk funny or not, I mean, I'm still me. I'm still me. And I want y'all to understand that. I do. But I'm going to let y'all go. You know, I'm still going to upload videos, so please stay tuned.